Hi, welcome to another episode of PSD TV. I'm your host, Alex Palt, and today I've got friend of the show, Case Lynx. He's with uh, Corvo and, uh, well, actually doing quite a lot of things. Case, welcome to the show. Hey, nice to meet you again. Well, you know, the nice thing about we're here at CES, there's a lot going on. Corvo is one of the companies that you're involved with. Can you tell me a little bit of, in general what you're really, the targets of the company here at the show? Now, Corvo is a very innovative company in communication space. And uh, we are, you know, uh, basically breaking barriers in finding new solutions for problems that we are running into every day. Let me give you an example. You know, uh, you have a door lock. Uh, in your car and you have a kind of a key fob to open your door lock in your house you don't have it you know right shall we fix that in your car you have it and in your house you don't really weird so we think about all your door locks in your house to be connected to the network and then be able with okay let's use your smartphone with your smartphone you open your door lock now let's think about it how does it work your smartphone has Bluetooth but your home network has Zigbee or thread so what does your door lock need? Your door lock needs a chip that talks Bluetooth and it talks part of the network, it talks Zigbee at the same time. Well, that's a chip that we are announcing here. It's called the GP695 and essentially it fixes that problem. It talks to your phone with Bluetooth, it talks to the home network with Zigbee. So if I'm building a if I'm designing a router for, say, for example, my application space, or let's say I'm just creating a router product, this would be one of the devices I would want to use or want to evaluate for it. Oh, absolutely. And then it's good that you talk about uh, the router because we also have a, a great announcement here of a other chip called the GP712. Ah. And that chip is a multi-radio chip that runs multiple stacks at the same time. So in the past, if you wanted to kind of be safe and do Zigbee and Thread and RF4CE, actually you had to put three chips in your router. Today, you can do one chip it runs three protocols over multiple channels at the same time. So multiple channels, multiple stacks for your router, and essentially you solve all the problems of the future. And, well, and that's, that's a big issue, the interoperability between systems, because unless you can speak all the languages, you're going to have a hole. We completely evaporate that issue because actually the consumer doesn't care about you know, what protocol is being used. What does the consumer care about? He cares about ease of installation, he cares about range, and he, ta he cares about long battery life. Actually, he wants battery life exceeding the life of the product, so that you don't have to worry about changing batteries whatsoever. And that's what we're talking about here. Uh, that's what these chips help you to uh, achieve. Well, and so I've sold, as my audience knows, I've said a long time, power sexy again because it's energy efficiency. It's, the whole issue is people will not tolerate devices that cannot last. Exactly, and that's the key focus of uh, Green Peak. And at the same time, you want to have enough range, right? You want to cover your house. So you don't want to kind of have to deal with uh, kind of uh, hopping from one device to another device to get to your router. You basically want to cover your whole house. And uh, range at the lowest power, that's where we stand for as a Corvo organization. Uh, very nice. Um, so what are some of the other advantages to the devices? I mean, obviously, they're not just simple translation devices. They have other functionalities. Yeah, I mean, there, there, are, there are many functionalities uh, included. Uh, but but the, real, the real power is that it takes away for the designer the concern to worry about what protocol is going to be winning in the future. You can just implement the device and the software will take care of whatever protocol you want to use at the same time. And you don't have to implement multiple chips either because multiple chips is the same radio that always have to wait for each other. You know, why would you use multiple chips? Very cool. Now, what about um, evaluation kits, demo kits, eval boards, anything like that? Do you provide support for the engineer for that? Available www.corvo.com. Excellent. Do you have any last words for our audience before we let you go, Case? Hey, the smart home is there. Better hop on the bus. <laughs> I agree. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it, Case. Hey, you're very welcome. Have a good show. Oh, thank you. And I'd like to thank all of you out there for taking the time to be with us. We wouldn't be here without you. Tell your friends. This is Alex Paul for Power Systems Design. Have a great day.